In this video, I'm gonna give you a quick overview of our nurse fanny pack. And so this can be used for any profession um, and in any setting, whether inpatient or outpatient. This is just an example that I have set up with the typical um, kind of inpatient setting where you'll be holding a lot of different things like your tape, your phone pens, IV caps, syringes, papers, kind of reference sheets, and scissors as well. Um, there's a lot of different pockets which I'll go through in just a second um, on a blank one. All right, so I'll kind of work my way outside and then kind of show you the inside. Really, there's two different sizes that this comes in, and then you can kind of decide which one will work best for you. There's a little bit of overlap in between. You have a nice buckle um, that can help secure the pack, and then this help resize for whatever size that, that fits you best. Here we have a what you can use to hold your tape. So you can either put your tape rolls in like that and kind of secure it down, or you can even use it for securing down some of your IV caps and then kind of just pin it down like so. The next pocket that I'll show you is this pocket right here. It's a Velcro pocket. You can either put in money, you can put in coins. Um, you can also uh, fit in your phone depending on the size of your phone and have it secured there. Likewise, you can easily put in your cell phone into this second pocket right here that can nicely fit in your phone and kind of have it tucked away so you can have it secure. There's many different pockets for your pens or different, uh, maybe even if you wanted to put syringes in there um, or even if you wanted to put something like a scissor, you can put those in as well. Okay, so all these pens, you have four of them here on the bottom row and then you have another two on the right and then you have a wider one that can fit bigger items like for example scissors can go into here if you have little reference sheets that you want to put in here or even something like a syringe. So a syringe can fit in here, they can also fit in these pen pockets as well. The next pocket that we have up here is a, a wider pocket that goes all the way across and here this is typically where you put bigger things for example like I, all your syringes can go in there. If you have little reference sheets as well or little cheat sheets, you can put these in a bigger pocket like so and then put all of your different syringes on top of that. Okay, so something like that will work well. And then finally on the back, what we have is we have a Velcro pocket that kind of surrounds the uh, whole width of the bag. And here what I like to use this for are things like paper. So you can just kind of stick in thin paper, it really doesn't have that much thickness to it, so it doesn't have that much give where you can put too much in there. But what I want this for was for putting in things like paper or something that may need to be a little bit more secure that's not just fully open on the outside. So those are just some ways that I like to use this fanny pack, but there's plenty of ways that you can fashion it yourself. Be sure to check out medicalbasics.com for more educational resources like our HP notebook. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tips and lessons.